you see all these video on demand acronyms? All these SVODs, TVODs, and AVODs? What are they? Well, we're gonna find out right now. SVOD is probably something you have already. It stands for Subscription Video On Demand. So it is a subscription-based model. Netflix and Amazon Prime are probably the most widely known options for SVOD. The great thing about SVOD is the amount of content they have available for you to consume on a daily basis. Binge much? Every time you consume a product on Netflix or Amazon Prime, it essentially makes that monthly payment a little bit less expensive per each item. Also, the flexibility of this subscription-based model in this day and age is fairly good. No long contracts, so that's a great step up over the traditional cable and satellite networks. TVOD stands for Transaction Video On Demand. Transaction-based means that you are making a payment to a company for their product or service, hence transaction. Companies like iTunes and Amazon have these transaction-based products available for you. When you might rent them, you'll have 48 hours to consume that once you've started watching it. Kind of like the old school video days where you'd go in and pay them, take a video, use it, take it back. It's kind of the same thing, but it's in the digital era. AVOD stands for Advertised Video On Demand. Now, these platforms you're probably using on a daily basis. As a matter of fact, you're using it right now. That's YouTube, where they run ads to consumers who are consuming products online. So when you watch a video, the creators put it up there, the corporation that's hosting it, like YouTube or Vimeo, possibly will put an ad on it. And then the creators of said videos, if they are monetized at that level, and if they have joined in on the monetization process, will get a cut monetarily of those advertising dollars to help them keep creating. Be on the lookout for changes coming in the near future with AVOD as Amazon has just recently filed for a trademark copyright of Amazon Tube. Dun, dun, dun. What does it all mean? Well, that means Amazon and Google have been like at each other's throats for years and years. And Amazon wants to get a piece of that AVOD by putting up their own creator consumer content. So that's kind of neat. There's no actual release date as of yet, but they are messing around with names and they are messing around with times. And you can be sure that those Amazon programmers are being slave driven 24 seven to get that bad boy up and running. Leave a comment down below about your favorite VOD platform and what you enjoy watching. Hit that like button if you are into VOD, which you are because you're watching it right now. And subscribe if you want more videos about getting your films made and market ready. I post every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and I will see you next time.